respiratory and circulatory systems in racing pigeons and how they impact performance. The respiratory and circulatory systems of racing pigeons play a critical role in delivering oxygen and energy to power flight. During intense flights, a pigeon's oxygen consumption can increase up to 15 times compared to resting levels, and up to 30 times during headwinds. To perform optimally, racing pigeons require robust respiratory and cardiovascular health to meet these extreme physiological demands. Any deficiencies in these systems can severely hinder a bird's ability to compete at the highest levels. Pigeons have uniquely adapted respiratory and circulatory systems that allow them to fly long distances at high speeds. Their efficient lung design, effective air sacs, strong heart, and rich network of capillaries all contribute to their athletic prowess. However, these systems are also highly vulnerable to disease and must be carefully monitored by pigeon fanciers. Even minor respiratory infections can escalate into career-ending illnesses if left untreated. The Anatomy and Function of Pigeon Respiration Pigeons utilize a sophisticated unidirectional respiratory system centered around a pair of lungs and a system of air sacs. The lungs contain tiny parabronchi rather than alveoli, which are profusely supplied with blood capillaries. This allows for more efficient gas exchange compared to mammalian lungs. Air first enters through the nares and passes through the nasal passages, which warm and humidify the air. It then travels past the larynx and trachea before entering two primary bronchi that branch directly into the lungs. Within the lung tissue, the parabronchi extract oxygen for diffusion into the bloodstream. The deoxygenated air then exits the posterior air sacs and re-enters the anterior air sacs. This unidirectional flow ensures fresh air is moved through the parabronchi during both inhalation and exhalation. The air subsequently passes through the lungs a second time before being exhaled through the trachea and nares. This unique arrangement allows for exceptional gas exchange efficiency, providing racing pigeons with their athletic edge. The air sac system is vital for oxygenating blood during flight. Air sacs act as bellows, moving air through the parabronchial lungs. Without properly functioning air sacs, pigeons quickly become oxygen-deprived. Nine interconnecting air sacs empty into the lungs, storing inhaled air and improving ventilation. Prior to strenuous flights, pigeons can hyperventilate to fill their air sacs with extra oxygen. This boost helps meet the intense metabolic demands of racing. Proper respiration is vital for thermoregulation. Pigeons dissipate excess heat through their mouths by vibrating their throat muscles to pant. Efficient panting prevents overheating during flights and allows pigeons to maintain stamina. Respiratory infections can disrupt this process and cause heat exhaustion. The heart and circulatory system. A strong cardiovascular system is required to rapidly deliver oxygenated blood from the lungs to the flight muscles. Pigeons have proportionately large hearts that constitute up to 3% of their body weight. Their cardiac output can increase by 5 to 10 times during flight compared to resting levels. This expanded pumping capacity is supported by an extensive network of capillaries surrounding the flight muscles. During sustained flights, up to 80% of a pigeon's cardiac output is directed towards the pectoral muscles that power the wings. Pigeons also utilize a dense network of countercurrent blood vessels in their wings. Arterial blood flowing towards the muscles passes closely alongside venous blood returning to the heart. Heat is efficiently transferred from the arterial side to pre-warm the venous blood, reducing heat loss. This counter-current design allows pigeons to maintain high muscle temperatures for sustained periods. Other adaptations include a large volume of red blood cells and high hemoglobin concentrations. This expanded oxygen carrying capacity fulfills the muscle's considerable aerobic demands. Pigeons also store excess red blood cells in their spleen that can be released into circulation during periods of exertion. Careful conditioning improves the heart and lung stamina and efficiency. Slow, long-distance flights stimulate cardiovascular development better than short, fast races. With proper training, racing pigeons build exceptional cardiovascular endurance required for competitive racing. The Impacts of Respiratory Disease Given their heavy reliance on respiration and circulation, disorders affecting these systems can be catastrophic for racing pigeons. Even mild respiratory infections and inflammation can limit oxygen delivery, lower performance, and predispose birds to heat stress. One of the most common and dangerous threats is chlamydiosis, a bacterial disease that can manifest as a respiratory infection. The bacteria severely damage the sinuses and air sacs, causing labored breathing, wheezing, and a frothy nasal discharge. Birds become exercise intolerant and are unable to complete races. 
In advanced cases, the air sacs can fill with fluid and fibrous tissue, irreparably impairing lung function. Chlamydial bacteria also attack the liver, heart, and spleen, further taxing the cardiovascular system. Swift antibiotic treatment is required to control outbreaks. Paratyphoid infection is another common cause of racing losses. Systemic infection causes diarrhea, sinusitis, and liver lesions. Sinus inflammation irritates the upper respiratory tract, while the ensuing fatigue and weakness stems from oxygen deprivation to the muscles. Secondary respiratory infections are frequent complications of paratyphoid. The damage to organs like the liver and spleen impairs immunity and allows opportunistic pathogens to colonize the respiratory tract. A bird recovering from paratyphoid requires close monitoring to avoid secondary illness. Ornithosis is a highly infectious viral respiratory disease that spreads rapidly between pigeons. The virus damages the sinus epithelium enabling secondary bacterial infections to take hold. Severe inflammation of the eyes, nares, and trachea make breathing difficult. Discipline required to complete races. The virus also attacks the heart muscle, contributing to poor circulation, lethargy, and exercise intolerance. Sudden death can occur in the midst of training due to myocarditis. Surviving birds suffer prolonged weakness and their racing abilities are often permanently affected. Strict quarantine measures are essential to control outbreaks. Fungal respiratory infections are also hazardous. Aspergillosis spores can colonize the trachea and air sacs, resulting in labored breathing, loss of stamina, and potential air sac rupture. Candidiasis impacts the crop, mouth, and esophagus, making eating and breathing uncomfortable. Both infections progress slowly, causing gradual performance decline in exercise intolerance. Bacterial and fungal pneumonias are serious complications seen with initial viral infections, stressful transport, or overcrowding. Pneumonia causes substantial inflammation and fluid buildup which obstructs oxygen exchange. Birds require aggressive treatment to prevent permanent lung damage. Preventing respiratory disease. Prevention is crucial when managing such a vulnerable system. Lofts should be dry, well ventilated, and cleaned daily to avoid the accumulation of fungal spores and ammonia fumes. Overcrowding stresses birds and facilitates contagion. Plentiful food, water, and bathing opportunities also support health. Annual vaccinations help protect against chlamydiosis, paratyphoid, pox, and ornithosis. Isolating and testing new additions prevents them from introducing infections. Promptly separating sick birds limits exposure. Racing pigeons should be monitored year-round for signs of respiratory disease. Early symptoms include discharge, sneezing, tail bobbing, open-mouth breathing, and lethargy. Canker, fungal plaques, conjunctivitis, and sinus swelling also warrant swift care. During peak training and racing, fanciers should watch for underperforming birds that fatigue prematurely or abandon races. These individuals should be examined and rested to determine if illness is the cause. Quick action prevents treatable conditions from progressing into untenable respiratory damage. With attentive management, respiratory infections can often be resolved before impacting performance. However, long-term lung damage is difficult to reverse. Winning birds must maintain peak cardiovascular and respiratory fitness. Fanciers should make respiratory health the cornerstone of their care regimen. The pigeon's throat, a key assessment tool. The pigeon's throat provides critical clues into current respiratory status that fanciers should learn to evaluate. Subtle changes in the throat's appearance can reveal issues before clinical symptoms appear. Making throat assessment part of the regular health checklist helps identify problems early. Ideally, the relaxed throat should appear bright pink, moist, and free of plaque or irritation. The central curtain should meet neatly with no gaping or adhesion. As the bird breathes, the throat tissues should move symmetrically without fluttering excessively. Stress leads to horizontal wrinkling of the throat curtains. During molting or conditioning, mild temporary lines may appear but shouldn't persist. Chronic stress taxes the adrenals, weakens immunity, and increases infection risk. Purple or blanched coloration indicates circulatory deficiencies or oxygen starvation. This signals an immediate need for rest and further medical evaluation. The bird likely harbors cardiac or respiratory illness. Racing must be halted to prevent collapse or death. Plaques or cassius formations point to chronic respiratory infection. Antibiotics are necessary to clear the infection before lasting damage occurs. Frothy mucus implies an acute illness in the trachea or air sacs. Severe panting and gaping indicates heat stress and potential exhaustion. 
The throat also acidifies in proportion to fatigue, making the curtains appear more orange. By tracking throat color during training, fanciers can monitor stamina. Acute acidosis means the bird is being pushed too hard and needs rest. Suboptimal throat quality reduces athletic performance. Narrowing from inflammation raises respiratory effort and oxygen consumption. Scarring lowers ventilation efficiency. Ideal throat health is essential for meeting the metabolic demands of racing. By frequently observing and interpreting the throat, fanciers gain invaluable insight into respiratory status. They can preemptively adjust training and care regimens to maintain health. Throat changes are often the first clinical signs of illness, allowing for rapid intervention. For accurate assessment, the bird must be calm and comfortable. Factors like heat, mating, stress, youth, and molting naturally alter the throat's appearance as well. Fanciers should learn the nuances through careful observation and build examination into their regular health routines. Summary Racing pigeons push their respiratory and circulatory capacities to the limits. The unique anatomy of their lungs and air sacs allows maximum gas exchange and oxygen storage for endurance flights. A sizable heart, dense network of capillaries, and abundance of red blood cells supply their flight muscles with copious oxygen. These systems are precisely adapted for athletic prowess but are vulnerable to myriad pathogens. Bacterial, viral, and fungal respiratory infections rapidly compromise performance and threaten careers. Even mild inflammation impairs ventilation and hampers oxygen delivery. Fanciers must be vigilant for signs of respiratory sickness and quickly isolate affected birds. Proper loft sanitation, ventilation, population density, nutrition, and annual vaccines are fundamental preventative measures. Careful conditioning and rest also maintain health. Observing the delicate tissues of the throat provides invaluable insight into a pigeon's respiratory status. Fanciers should learn to regularly and effectively evaluate the throat. Its appearance reveals developing illness prior to advanced symptoms. By understanding these intricacies, fanciers can optimize their bird's respiratory fitness and achieve success in the competitive world of pigeon racing. Peak performance demands robust oxygen exchange. The respiratory and cardiovascular systems are the ultimate determinants of victory or defeat. Get my main racing system, just email me direct. I'm an experienced ex-pigeon racer from England, and I can offer valuable insights and guidance on all aspects of pigeon racing, from breeding to racing. During my racing days, I managed a small team of no more than 70 pigeons, including stock, young birds, and old birds. It was not uncommon for me to send as few as six birds to a race and still secure the top three positions out of up to 2,500 pigeons in my club and federation. My race distances typically ranged up to 300 miles, and I consistently achieved top five placements in my club. My expertise extends to the art of selecting excellent breeders, including evaluating pigeons based on their assigned characteristics. I firmly believe that true champions can only be bred from top quality stock, and I can guide you in identifying and acquiring such pigeons. I understand that many pigeons for sale are advertised based on their lineage or pedigree, but I emphasize the importance of assessing the bird itself rather than relying solely on paperwork. As part of my offer, I invite you to share photos of your pigeons, including their eye sign and wing characteristics. I'll provide you with free advice on racing and breeding based on my extensive experience and knowledge. Additionally, I will share auction links to high-quality breeding birds that have the potential to produce winners in your loft. Here's what you can expect to receive from me. A comprehensive Word document containing valuable insights and strategies for successful pigeon racing, including specific racing methods for both old and young birds, as well as general advice. Private YouTube videos sent to your email, covering various aspects of pigeon racing, from breeding to race preparation. Detailed recommendations on supplements and additives to add to your pigeon's drinking water, with scientific evidence supporting their effectiveness. Similar products are used by professional athletes and racehorses to enhance performance. Assurance that your pigeons will race home faster, provided that you have quality birds to begin with.